G'day everyone, it's Angelo Ramora here. I'm your favorite Australian and the real estate dingo bringing you another blog. And today I'm talking about turnkey investing. Is it really worth it? Let's get it started. All right guys, so I'm going to be a Debbie Downer today and I'm gonna be talking a little bit negatively about turnkey real estate because what I absolutely love doing is talking myself out of business. Um, for those of you that don't know, I've been in turnkey for around six years now. Um, and run a pretty cool company, but whatever, let's just talk ourselves out of business, so here it goes. Uh, look, is turnkey real estate worth it? Um, guys, it's just very unfortunate that um, there's a huge stigma surrounding turnkey real estate, and, and rightly so. At the end of the day, there's just way too many operators um, that are selling properties for way more than what they're worth in crappy areas, and then passing on investors to third-party property management companies um, or even in-house property management companies that are just known to nickel and dime to death. Um, so what you're actually promised on paper is what you never really achieve in real life. Um, are there good turnkey companies out there? There sure are, but unfortunately, the majority of them are pretty crap. So um, is turnkey worth it? Look, uh, I speak to so many investors, and I, I swear, if I check my CRM right now, there's probably over 3,000 logged phone calls um, that I have had over the last six years with investors coming to me wanting to buy turnkey real estate. And the majority of those investors that we turn down or where it's just not a right fit is like crazy, crazy, crazy amounts. Like I feel that it's just crazy how many people we, we don't work with. And, and I'll tell you why. Um, so in my honest opinion, um, if turnkey is going to be worth it for you, um, then you should not probably have this particular personality that I'm about to talk about right now. And it's quite simple. Summarized in one statement, it goes like this. If you think you know it all, you should do it all yourself. <laughs> okay, so let me repeat that. If you think you know it all, you should do it all yourself. Find the property, buy the property, renovate the property, get it tenanted, and manage it. You do not need a turnkey company, guys. And look, there's a lot of investors out there that I've come across, and I'm sure many other turnkey operators have come across, you know, when they connect with them on the phone or via email or whatever it may be, you know, the investors um, uh, think they know it all. They're, they're, they're telling you how thick the carpet should be and what color walls you should paint, um, along with various other things. Another thing that I've also found is, you know, a lot of investors do not want to let go of the reins. They want to call the shots um, and they want to be, um, you know, informed on every little decision that's made literally on a, on a daily basis. So pretty much guys, you know, is turnkey worth it? Um, no, it's not. Like if that is your personality and if that is, you know, what your expectations are, turnkey real estate is not worth it and you shouldn't do it and you should just do it all yourself. Why? Because you're probably going to get better deals. Honestly, you're not going to have to pay anyone's margin. Um, you'll be able to buy the property distressed at a, at a, at a great price. You'll be able to fix it um, for whatever you're going to fix it for. And of course, when you get it tenanted, you're probably not gonna have to pay any property management fees because you're gonna self-manage. So in itself, you're gonna get a much, 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 much better return on investment from a cash flow standpoint. You're also gonna get an equity gain um, from the initial kind of stage of buying it and renovating it. Um, and when you kind of think about that, um, you know, uh, you're, you're way ahead of the game in my opinion. Now, if you do want to be passive and you don't wanna do any work and you don't wanna, you know, control the entire process and hold on to the reins, then turnkey real estate might be for you, but you have to understand that you're not gonna get the best deals. Reality, I mean, there's nothing else I can say. You're not gonna get the best deals, and in many, many instances, you will be paying more than what the property is worth. I mean, of course, you're gonna have a property manager that's gonna charge whatever fees they need to charge to, to make ends meet and to, and to cover costs. So, um, guys, summarizing everything. If you think you know it all, do it all yourself, and turnkey real estate is not worth it, and you should not invest in turnkey. But if you don't think you know it all and you're pressed for time and you don't want to control the process, well then turnkey real estate might be worth it for you. So um, that's pretty much it guys. That concludes my blog for today. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I'd love to hear from you. Who's investing in turnkey? Comment below. Um, have you had success? Um, do you agree with what I'm saying? You know who I'd really love to hear from? Um, I'd love to hear from investors that are buying turnkey properties and are able to buy them at below market value. Um, I personally have not heard of anyone being able to do that successfully. So if you have, I'd love to hear from you. Um, but guys, that's pretty much it. Once again, I'm Angela Ramora. I'm your favorite Australian 
and the real estate dingo. I'll catch you in the next vlog.